Hey guys, Shane here, Crypto Fish YouTube channel. So we're going to go over some Cardano news today and see what my riding rigs did the last 24 hours. See if I'm going to hit my um, weekly, uh, weekly record. See you in a bit. Hey guys, real quick before we go on, uh, I got something called Bitcoin Fridays. Um, Enter the Win video came out yesterday. Link will be under the uh, first um, comment below. Head over to that video, enter your BTC wallet address so you'll be entered to win. Uh, if you're new here, be sure to subscribe, hit that bell icon so you'll be notified of future updates. All right, so let's get into the news. All right, so let's head over to right here. Cryptocurrency news, uh, Cardano brand refresh, Cardano gets a roadmap overhaul. Um, input output, IOHK, the tech company that builds and funds Cardano, announced yesterday that Cardano has undergone a major brand refresh. Aesthetics have always been on the back burner for the project, as the founder's efforts have always been focused primarily on its peer-reviewed, built-from-the-ground-up technology. Unlike many other projects within the crypto space, the Cardano project focuses, uh, focuses less on marketing tactics, kind of like Tron, and more on providing investors weekly technical reports. Cardano also has the most transparent roadmap, um, roadmap among all, uh, all the cryptocurrencies. Investors and users have the, have the constant ability to check what components are being worked on, who is working on them, and what percentage they are completed. Um, new and improved. The IOHK team sought to make the current website and roadmap more intuitive to use. They also wanted to be able to convey their data more efficiently and more effectively, giving users the overall big picture, but also allowing them to drill down the details if they so wish. Um, I'll leave a link down in the description to the um, new Cardano site. You can see some pics here of it. Um, it is pretty, uh, like they said, it's a complete rebrand and everything. After nailing down a foundation, IOHK's visual designer, Julie Sudi, worked with a community member and graphic designer from, the Germany, from Germany to improve the project's roadmap. Today, they officially launched a newly refreshed roadmap, which is full of new features. Um, a little something from Daniel Friedman here. In the final stages of preparing this week's Cardano's weekly technical report, uh, more good info on Goguen, Cardano decentralization, test nets, and more coming your way. Stay tuned. That was on, I think it was on June 6th, right there. Uh, you can view all the project's updates via their roadmap, but Cardano also provides weekly technical reports that give a breakdown of the team's advancements. This week's technical report should be released shortly. As you can see above, it's full of rich updates and information. Cardano, well, this is a couple of days ago. is at a 21 cents. Let's see what it is right now. Scroll this down a bit, click search. So, Sent at about 17 cents today, up 10%. That's a nice little boost. Uh, so let's go to some price predictions right here, over here on Coin Telegraph. Cardano continues to slide down, slide towards its next major support of 13 cents, which it was right on it a couple days ago, probably about two days ago. This support it held between March 18th and April 6th on a closing UTC basis. So. Um, going on, hence we believe that buying will again emerge near the 13 cent level. The RSI is also close to the oversold levels, which points to the possibility of a bounce off the major support. So there it is right there. It looks like every time it's come close or actually gone down under in the oversold area, Cardano bounces back. Pretty much every time. Didn't really touch there, but it came back up. Hit there, went down underneath it, came back up, touched there, went back up again. 
here we are again hit it bounce back up and now we're right here um, that's pretty much today today you get late yesterday we're touching that level again so it should jump back up again and I think this was taken when was this article written 16 hours ago okay so 16 hours ago this was written getting at around 13 cents we'll see if we can narrow that down and now it's at 17 cents so let's look at this with zoom in so 13 hours ago or 16 hours ago 15 we're sitting down right around it got looks like it got down to about 15 cents not quite 13 cents but it got pretty close and there it is coming back up again so might be a time to buy I guess this of course this is not financial advice um, but I might think about scooping some more up um, myself actually uh, so what I'm doing actually now I convert my Ethereum to Bitcoin right here. Got $31.70 so far this week converted to Bitcoin. I may take that, stop that, and might buy, might buy a little more Cardano. Again, this is just me and what I'm doing. You'll have to do a little research yourself and make that decision on your own. So while we're here, this is my uh, mining rig uh, updates page. AMD rig, NVIDIA rig, NVIDIA rig is mining Electronium right now. Got 836 mines so far this week at $11.69. AMD rig mines Ethereum, converts it to Bitcoin. And like I said just a minute ago, $31.70 so far this week. All in all, I'm a little surprised. I'm at $45.80. Um, I will finalize those numbers about 10 o'clock tonight like I do every week. Um, I won't hit 50. Last week I was at 51.59, 49.02 the week before that. I think I should get around $48 probably this week. So after a pretty bad week with for uh, cryptocurrencies, last week Bitcoin was 76.95 this time, and we're down over a thousand dollars. So. With everything being down that much in the past week, and I'm still up, probably going to finish about $48. That's still pretty good. Um, $387 total mined so far since I started. So this is uh, into my fifth month now. And that's just because everything has been down for the past couple months. Bounces back a little bit, but it's, if you watch, look at the charts. Let's go back over here and we'll just click on um, Bitcoin and look at that. Seems that that's the major player. And there's the spike right there. And we've just been going down and down and down. So I have my profits and everyone else's. But I'm holding all these coins. These are all the coins I've mined so far 1682 Electronium. Actually, it should update that. I got a little bit more here a second ago. Uh, 3,700 Verge, 2,500 Raven, 1,700 Tron, 110 Cardano, and that's what put Bitcoin at 0 0.014. At least that's just from mining. All this is just from mining, not other investments I got. But once this thing turns around, which I'm hoping it does. And this thing starts going up, even if it doubles, doubles in price. And uh, some of these altcoins got the potential, especially Electronium, to three and four times its price. So this could easily turn into seven, eight hundred, maybe a thousand bucks real quick. So at least that's what I'm hoping. Um, Mining Pool Hub just cashed out Electronium, hits 250, and I uh, get a cash out. Um, over to uh, my wallet and of course here's the ethereum converting that to Bitcoin everything's going good there here is my SMOS which runs my um, AMD rig 119 mega hash on ethereum that has been up now with six days 18 hours flawless no errors we got 16,000 total shares accepted none rejected
uh, none rejected. So this rig is running nice and smooth, no problems. Let's go ahead and log in real quick to my um, NVIDIA rig, check that out. So here we are in the um, NVIDIA rig. It's one that runs on Windows. It's running fine, let's click results. 3,061 uh, accepted shares. Only got one rejected. So this thing's running, running perfect. This is the um, 1070 Ti, two 1060s and the CPU. So I guess, guys, um, that's going to be it for today. Um, like I said earlier, if you guys are new to the channel, be sure to subscribe. Hit that bell icon below. Um, the Bitcoin Fridays Enter to Win video will be in the first comment. Go there, enter your BTC wallet address so you'll be eligible to win. And I will do that drawing tomorrow. All right, guys. So with that. I will see you all in the next one, which will be tomorrow, where we will draw the winner for Bitcoin Fridays. If you guys have any questions or comments, just put them down below, and I will get back to you. All right, guys, take care. Bye.